Hi everybody, you have found what to play next for bringing everything that is awesome, and I do mean awesome in gaming. So this is Crow Country. We have this great um, community of indie devs on Twitter, um, a little bit on Facebook. Um, indie Adventure Games is really fun. And then we're building one on Reddit as well. Um, they do have an indie gaming, like indie gaming, indie expo. Um, we're trying to get a little bit more into like game hints or game guides. Um, so you can showcase your games there as well if you're a dev, or um, check them out if you're a player. Survival, horror, or exploration? <laughs> you will not be attacked. We'll do survival, horror. We might as well. You guys are feeling masochistic, right? So, let's take a look. <gasps> I broke it. Oh. It's just, it's gonna keep doing that if I hit tab on. If I wanna make sure it's recording my face, it's gonna cut me off. Ooh, we're dialing back time, okay. So it's 1990, this is ancient history, children. Like it's an Omni or something. If anyone asks, my name is Mara. It's not a very common name. Mara Forest. That's if that is your real name. I knew Mara, especially Jin Forest. Her name is made up too. That's me, don't forget. Don't mess it up. How would I mess that up? Like, what is my role in this that I have the capability of messing up your name? So, all these things and more, we wonder. I got viewers and they got questions. <laughs> Alright, Mara. What do you got for me? Huh? Is it a mystery? I have no visual. Is this... Mara, is this normal? <laughs> there we go. It's like, am I supposed to be seeing... Oh, cool! I like it! Look at this! It's got, like, a J French Japanime mashup. Satan's candy corn has been strewn all over the place. <laughs> Deaf parking only. Private property keep out. It's chained up. Well, we might as well examine it, even though headlock looks rusty. We probably break with enough force. I better go open the trunk of my car. That was really specific. This game is made for stupid people like me. I don't know about you, but like when I am in the middle of something, like if I'm doing something and I'm playing a video game, I want it to tell me what to do next. Stock up on ammo. Got it. We're just gonna leave that open because we're like that. All right, how do I take game? Not with left trigger. <laughs> okay, single shot should do it. What do you think does that? Right button. Oh, I don't have to. It's not requiring that I do that. <laughs> I see this so clearly now. Right button. Got it. And then that's fire. Chamber by a bullet is different. Nice! Look at me go. Push it open. Make it happen. Walking on arrows, got it, on it, tearing it up, living life. Why do I have this feeling? It's a circus music, well, carnival music. I have no intention of buying a ticket. Look at you, you rebel, just announce it. What's this? I don't, I don't know. It's a pocket light. Looks like somebody dropped it. Nice, very nice. That is a body light. Okay. It's a main gate. Let's examine that. It leads out to the public parking lot. It's been blocked ever since they shut down Crow County. Look at this. I love the little cartoon. You said V mannequin. Is anybody here? It's a nice room magazine. Place used to be fairly popular with little clothes. Megabyte magazines, tips and tricks. You can hold down B or right trigger to run. Take advantage of using right triggers that it frees you up. Okay, cool. So we are obviously going to get massive amounts of. Ew! Oh, we got a med kit. That is not traditionally what happens when you stick your hand in the trash, children. Just like as a heads up. 
Tickets have always been pretty cheap. So we're just, we're gonna do it, right? Like you and me. It's the main gate. I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna find the crows. Or whatever it is we're looking for. All we know so far is her name is Mara, and don't mess it up. Link in the description below if you do want to play along. All stung has Gamer Grind. Gamer coffee shipped to your door. Put your logo on merch for like nothing bucks. You could support the pirate queen. Um, great coffee too. KOFI, buy this chick a coffee one dollar make me smell, or Patreon. We do a lot of pro bono work for the indie community. Everything from marketing, media, uh, locational, play testing, etc. Beta testing. Nice. Apparently, every time you open a garbage can, an RPG or gets a, its bandages. Can we go in? Wow, it, this is really cool exploratory. But yes, you can support us on Patreon on a monthly basis if you want to you know, support gaming in general. A game in particular, you can certainly take a look at. Um, is this is where I store my. Oh, are we gonna do it? Okay, I don't need that right now, thankfully. Okay, I was hoping that they didn't stash things in there. There's something in there, but I can't get it. It's blocked by a pile of old bones. That doesn't work. Okay, so I have an ID card and that's it. Ew. Ew, ew. This just got real. Beyond Magazine. Strange sighting in an abandoned theme park. Aspiring paranormal photographer Arthur Molson and poor you to go exploring the abandoned amusement park throughout Crow Country. How could this thing possibly be real or is it just another hoax? Here at Beyond Magazine, we're not convinced. Try a little harder next time, Arthur. Oh, weird. Well, that's interesting. Can't open it. Something's blocking it. I bet it's a dead body. In a butt? <laughs> The urinal. Seems so convenient. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Oh, that looks like everything. What's that? Laser sight. Who left this lying around? You know, I felt the same way about the, uh... About the ammunition, but who am I? Vending machines and trash cans may provide you with supplies. Get the handgun from the trunk of your car. Get the hand dryer. Alright, so, um, nice noir sort of. We're waiting for the jump scares. I assume that they're not gonna swarm you. They look like they're really trying to set you up to actually interact with the environment and actually experience the story of this amusement park. Okay, you can't jimmy the lock there. <laughs> Figured it was worth a try. If you didn't know that before, you didn't learn it from me. Hello, Mr. Crumb. Looking for your boss. Do you know where he is? Vending machine. I think the graininess like adds to it. It's interesting. Nice! Bottle of antidote. You know. I wonder what you get poisoned with. Each discovery makes me less sure I'm going to survive. Large med kit. The rewards increase. I love that the posters are interactable. More people should do that. Where, like, you can actually look at something. You know, and it'll give you more. It doesn't have to be that you found a piece of whatever lying around. You can actually just have stuff on the walls. The hole for something to be inserted. I really gotta find something beyond my ID card med kits here. Hello. You have 10 credits remaining. Would you like to hear your fortune? Obviously, I would. Clearly. Talk to the tree fairy to enter the fairy pond. Wow, that was really just more instructions than anything else, but okay. So I need to find some sort of tool to get these doors open. Oh, hello, here's another one. It's a staff memo. Oh. Something wrong with the ventilator in the fairy pond area. We think something might have crawled in the pipe and died. Don't run the ventilator if you do hold your breath seriously. Finally, I admit I dropped her bronze key in the fairy pond. It was an accident. It was such a problem with me to spare. It's a silver key, huh? I actually really like 
the gating um, trope where you have to have like different keys to get to different places. I think it's a lot of fun. So I can shoot things. So far there hasn't been anything super scary. It looks like we're gonna backtrack and open those gates later. Fairy tale town, how cool. Look at this. Well, let me see if there's anything I can do with the barrel. What's this? 2106, remember that, 2106 guys. Is it a code for something? Going with yes. Oh, we'll go around the bear trap just in case that's a real thing. Great ammo. Yes, I want a Polaroid camera. Oh, wow. Oh, it's a dude. Hi, dude. What happened here? My name is Mara Forrest. I'm here to help. They attacked me. All I wanted was proof. What's your name? Arthur Mull. Just need a better, a clearer photo. A photo of what? What attacked you? Those things. I don't know. People, they saw me. You're bleeding quite badly. I should help them. What did you say your name was? Mara. Let's take a look at your leg. Give him a med kit. Cool! Maybe he'll recover now. It's in the theater. I think it's blocked from the other side. So there's a lot of things that you can interact with, but they are putting um, some sort of gates in. You can be not allowed to smoke and still want a pack of ciggies for somebody else, you know? It's people. It is going to be, it looks like it is going to be a slow um, storyline progression. So we are going to cut it a little bit short. We try not to let them run on too long. Oh, okay. Here we go. Who's got this? We do. No, that's the wrong way. I don't even understand what just happened there. All right. I need to sight. So we're sighting. I'm going to get it. Make me do it. Oh, we're dying. Whoa, how many bullets does this take? Maybe I need to headshot him. I'm out of ammo. How do I reload? There we go. I have to shoot it in the head. Oh my god. That is horrifying. Wow. They took way too long to die. Is that the thing he was trying to get a picture of? Feel that bleeding alive. So we love you guys. We love that you're as long for ride. Hit like and subscribe. We love when you hit the like button, but definitely smash subscribe and hit the bell and we will see you next video. If you wanted a good thriller JRPG style, but also with a French twist, then this is it. Is there something inside?